Hello, hello, Veronica Brandon. How are you two this morning? Hi, Angel. Did you guys have your breakfast this morning? I have mine. I have my coffee and my granola bar. Oh, that is hot. Good morning, everybody. Let me know what y'all had for breakfast. And I swear if you say pizza rolls. <laughs> Hi, Anthony. No pizza rolls. <laughs> Hi, Jamie. Hi, Stephanie. No pizza rolls. Alejandra, I do have to say that whenever I went to the store last night, of course, I wear my mask and take all those precautions. But whenever I was going down like the freezer aisle, I saw pizza rolls and I started laughing because I thought of you all. And no, I did not get any. So I apologize. Had an orange. Look at you being healthy. Ooh, I do have some apples I could eat. Who eats their apples with peanut butter? Like you take an apple and you like slice it up and then you dip it in peanut butter. Oh, that is like my favorite snack ever. Hayden, hello. Miss you, buddy. Hope you're doing okay. <clears throat> Well, those who haven't tried it, you have to try it. It's really, really, really good. Okay, who got done with morning work this morning? I could actually go and see who got done. Let's see. Okay, so who, okay, oops. I think it loaded. So got done with morning work. Awesome. Veronica, I do remember that about you and peanut butter. I remember that you don't like it. So who liked the morning work the past two days? We had like the multiplication. You had to find it in the uh, little crossword puzzle. Who actually enjoyed it? Like who thought it was a good change? They um, kind of liked it. I think I'm gonna change up morning work from here on out. I might do some of the same um, pages like we do, um, but it's not gonna be just like multiplication. I just wanted to try that for um, today and yesterday, but it's so y'all can practice your multiplication. Those who found it easy uh, means that you've been practicing your multiplication. Those who are finding it a little bit difficult uh, means that you need to practice more, okay? Um, it does take a while, probably not so much of like putting in the answers, but like actually finding them in the puzzle um, probably does take a little bit. Um, so I thought that would be fun and kind of a nice change for you all for your morning work. But I have a lot of more, like a lot more um, pages in mind to put on your morning work from here on out just to kind of change it up. Um, I think it will be a good change as well. Okay. Um, go ahead and open up your class kick. If it's not open already and I will unlock the math assignment for today. Before we get into math, I do have a few announcements I do want to go over. So go ahead and get that opened up. <clears throat> okay. So yes, it is Wednesday. Um, Fridays, I want to make kind of like a catch up day. So if you feel like you are super behind on a lot of work from this week, from the past two days, um, not just with me, but like with science, with any specials, um, those who go with Miss Fenton, Miss Gilbreth, or Mr. Kim, um, Friday is your catch-up day, okay? So that will be really nice. I will still have morning work every single day, but like a new math assignment, um, like anything like that, a whole chapter, I'm not going to do that on Fridays. That's just going to be a catch-up day, okay? Um, so I think a lot of you will um, really enjoy that and find that as a nice little breather for you um, so you don't have to worry about trying to get everything done in a certain amount of time. Um, my next thing I want to talk about is piecing yourself. 
please don't wait until Friday, your catch-up day, to try to do everything, okay? I'm still looking at the math assignment from yesterday, and a lot of you did not finish it. Um, I know three of you who have a habit of opening it, and then you maybe do like one or two problems, and then you close it out completely. Um, I'm letting you all know that these are worth a grade, okay? And this week... I did get told that I need to put in zeros from here on out, okay? Um, I really don't want to put in zeros from the past three weeks, but even if I did, um, they're not going to look very good. So those who are logged on to class kick really quick, uh, look at the Tuesday lesson 15 math assignment. Um, and some of you need to finish it up, meaning that it's not even started. Okay, so take a look at that. This all will be open until Sunday, so don't worry about it. Um, so I'm just letting you all know of that, okay? Hi, Miss Vincent. Okay, so who has their Tuesday Lesson 15 pulled up right now? They are looking through it. Let me know if you are. <clears throat> and again, that's logging on to Class Kick with your uh, FSI email, and then password is ABC. Okay, so hi, Miss Fatima. So Stephanie, you're looking at it. Veronica, you're looking at it. And Angel, um, I can tell you the ones for sure who are good to go on this assignment, um, and that they don't need to look back at it. So Alejandro, you are good. Um, April, you are good. Um, Brandon, I need you to go back. Um, so if I say your name and if you are good, you don't have to look back on it. Okay. Um, Jamie, there are a couple things that you could look on slide six, four. Oh yeah. You didn't finish that one. So Jamie, go back and look. Um, Jennifer, go back and look. Angel, you are good. Um, Jocelyn, you need to finish. Um, David, if you are on here, you need to finish and look back on slide six. Um, some of you are forgetting to put that decimal point, which makes your answer wrong. So if I go back and circle them, you'll need to change them, okay? And just put in that decimal. Stephanie, Veronica, you both are good. Um, Veronica, let me look at yours. Veronica, I'm circling two on that last page there. So take a look at them. Um, those need to be in decimal form, not fraction form, okay? Um, Adrian, we're talking about the lesson from yesterday. Um, so this is Tuesday, lesson 15. Um, so Adrian, you need to go back and then look at the ones I circled for you. Um, those numbers need to be in decimal form, okay? Because I think you just put them in, uh, I don't think you put them in decimal, so you'll have to go back and look at those, okay? Um, yeah, I would go back and double check all of those. Okay. All right, so if I said that you were good, um, you don't have to go back on that math assignment. Um, if I circled it and I forget to take off the circle because you changed it, um, I'll have to go back later and do that. But... Um, those who I did not say you're good, that means you have to go back and finish that assignment from yesterday, okay? Um, we are moving on to lesson 16 today for decimals, and this is the last lesson in Eureka Math for decimals, the last lesson, okay? Um, I'm also going to make it a requirement for you all to do Zern, okay? So I think by next Tuesday, next Tuesday or Wednesday, you need to be done with module six in Zern. Like I'm making that a requirement. I'm making that a grade. You need to be done with module six for Zern. And I can look up right now to see who is even um, close to that. Um, let me go to reports. Okay. Okay, 
With that being said, that doesn't mean that Zern is the only thing that you need to focus on. Like you still need to do the lessons as well. I require for you all to get on Zern about 20 minutes a day. If you do more than that, great, but it has to be at least 20 minutes a day, especially for those who are still struggling with decimals. Okay. Um, we will have like a small little quiz next week over decimals. And so um, that's why I'm implementing Zern to make sure that you all are fully prepared for it. Okay. Um, looking at Zern progress right now for module six, Veronica, I see that you've been doing a lot. Dave, you as well. Um, Kira, Stephanie, Adrian, Jennifer, Jordan, uh, Jocelyn, you've been doing a lot too. Um, so that's awesome. But some of like a lot of you are on lesson, like I think the highest lesson I see is lesson four. Um, Jordan and Jocelyn, that's you two. Um, but there are 16 lessons, my friends, 16 lessons in Zern that you will need to get done with by next week. OK, um, so I would say to really focus on Zern today, tomorrow and especially Friday. Um, if you can get on it during the weekend, great. If um, you want to take a break because that's your weekend, that's fine. Um, but I'm letting you know, letting you all know that you must get on Zern to get done with all of the lessons by next week. OK. Hi, Miss Jennifer. Okay, so um, if I did not call your name for module or lesson 15 from yesterday, um, that means that you need to go back to Tuesday's lesson and finish that math assignment, okay? All right, I will go ahead and open up the lesson for today. Um, it does have a sprint. So if you all want to do the sprint first and then go back to it, um, I need a erase some of my things on here. Oops. Then that is up to you all. Okay. Um, I need to make some changes on this assignment really quick and then I will open it up. But go ahead and get logged into Class Kick if you haven't already. Come on. And let me make these last few changes then I will get it open for you all. Okay. Um, okay, give me, come on, now why did it show up like that? Does anyone have any questions for me concerning your math assignment and concerning CERN? Because if so, ask me now. Make these last few changes. Okay. I wrote on your assignment from yesterday and I forgot to take it off. So let me go ahead and do that really quick. Okay. Um, almost done. Okay, so like I said, if you still have a lot that you need to do, um, that's fine. Just take today, tomorrow, and Friday to try to work on all of that, okay? Okay, I think I have it good now, hopefully. Okay, cool. Okay, um, login info, Stephanie, it's the um, email address that you have whenever you log into Google. And so if you have Google opened up, Stephanie, you can go on to your account. So go on to google.com, top right corner, 
um, you can click on that button and you can go to your accounts and then you can see it, that email address in there, okay? So it's that email address and the password is ABC, okay? Um, yeah, Hayden, you have a meeting with Miss Craig this morning at 1115, okay? Yeah, y'all can start doing the math. Let me go ahead and get this fully opened up for you all. Okay, now it is unlocked. Let me go ahead and paste the stuff in our chat here. Okay, so tutorial video, it is right here. Okay, just posted the tutorial video in the chat. You need, you need, you need to go through the tutorial video and do the problem set first, okay? You do have a sprint, don't forget about that sprint, um, but the, that tutorial video is not an option, it is a necessity, you need to go through it, okay? Um, don't forget CERN, um, try to get on it sometime today for at least 20 minutes if you haven't already. Um, holes, you have a chapter in holes today that you will need to read and finish. Um, a lot of you did it yesterday, um, but you need to go back to Monday to make sure you did Mondays and Tuesdays, I think. 12 of you did it on Monday, 12 of you did it on Tuesday. So I feel like it's the same 12, so good job. And then you have chapter 16 for holes today, okay? I will go live again at 12. Please don't forget to check in with Miss Finton, Miss Gilbreth, and Mr. Kim today by um, at least 11. So those who go with um, those three teachers, or at least one of the three teachers, um, you will need to check in with, with them today, okay? All right, good luck on your math assignment and check your email. Yes, check your email, check your email. Um, good luck on your math assignments. Let me know if you have any questions. Email me or you can raise your hands. Love you guys. I'll see you later. Bye-bye.